This video will cover the topic, Adding Rational Expressions with Linear Denominators Without Common Factors, Basic. Let's jump right into an example problem. Let's add the rational expressions 6 over x plus 2 plus 5 over x minus 1. Don't we need to make the denominators the same before we add the two fractions? You're right. To do this, we need to find the least common denominator of 6 over x plus 2 and 5 over x minus 1. Since x plus 2 and x minus 1 don't have any common factors, the least common denominator will be the product of the two original denominators. When we multiply x plus 2 times x minus 1, this results in a least common denominator of the quantity x plus 2 times the quantity x minus 1. How do we manipulate our fractions so that they have that denominator? In the first expression, 6 over x plus 2, the denominator already has the factor x plus 2. It is missing the factor x minus 1, so we can multiply this expression by x minus 1 over x minus 1. This results in 6 times the quantity x minus 1 over the quantity x plus 2 times the quantity x minus 1. Okay. So, since the denominator in the second expression already has the factor x minus 1, and is missing the factor x plus 2, we can multiply the expression by x plus 2 divided by x plus 2, right? Exactly. This results in 5 times the quantity x plus 2 over the quantity x plus 2 times the quantity x minus 1. Now we can complete the addition by distributing the numerators, and then adding the numerators while keeping the denominators the same. Finally, we can combine like terms to simplify. So, is this our final answer, or can we further simplify our numerator and denominator? Since 11x plus 4 and the quantity x plus 2 times the quantity x minus 1 have no common factors other than 1, we can't simplify any further. Okay, I think I understand. To add rational expressions where the denominators are linear and don't have any common factors, we will multiply the denominators to find our least common denominator. From there, we can complete the addition and simplify. That's exactly right. Great work!